yourself to the readers of Life on, Life on the Pamlico. Well, my name is Brandon Hardison, and I'm a charter captain on uh, the Pamlico River, the Roanoke River, and um, also charter fish out of Moorhead City. Right. So, how did you get started fishing? Uh, my grandfather uh, introduced me to fishing when I was a little kid, and as soon as I was able to walk, I was going on a boat, and you know, me and him, we spent a lot of time together. What do you enjoy about fishing the most? Um, I just like going out there and just spending time with uh, with family and friends, and um, you know, just get out and just just have a good time. And has your fishing experience ever helped you with your videography or vice versa? Yeah, um, I do. Um, it, it's helped me out a lot with uh, videography because. Um, I've also uh, filmed during the Big Rock Blue Marlin tournament, and since I know how to um, I know how to fish, I was able to run camera, learn how to get the right shot, and um, you know put my camera to the most use by making um, getting the correct correct footage and those type of things. What exactly do you do with your business? Um, I run nighttime drum charters. I run um, my backup captain on a charter boat out of Moorhead City, and also um, do a little um, little daytime fishing out in the river, flounder, drum, trout, those type of fish. I know you like to fish with your grandfather a lot. Is there anybody else you like to fish with? I like fishing with your dad, cause he he is he's something else and. I like fishing. Um, I like fishing with you sometimes too. You know, it just depends. But I don't like it though when you throw crabs on me and <laughs> those kind of things. Oh, good. Let's see here. How important is your boat to your company? And can you tell us about how it's set up? Um, I got a 22 foot Nautic Star. Got a uh, 250 Honda on it. Got a power pole on it. And um, you know, the boat is the main tool that you need. You know that and your gear. If you don't have a nice boat, people don't want to go on your boat. So you have to spend a lot of money to make money. And sometimes you have to go out on a limb and hope that you can make some money by spending thousands and thousands of dollars on you know, a vessel or any type of boat. Where's your favorite, favorite place to fish and why? I like going out fishing in Bath because um, I like going flounder fishing catch trout, you know, you can catch a little bit of everything in Bath, and um, it's not far from home, about 30 minutes, and you don't have to have a very big boat if you want to fish in Bath, or even say fish out in Washington. Do you have any fun fishing stories to share with the readers? Yeah, um, it's been a while back, me and my friend Johnny, we were fishing, and um, I remember Johnny threw his bait up in the bushes and he wanted me to go get it and I pulled the boat up to go get the bait out of the bushes and um, he, he jumped out. We didn't realize we were next to a guy that had a little emu farm. So um, all of a sudden Johnny gets back in the boat and an emu sticks his head through the bushes over Johnny's shoulder and Johnny freaks out because there's an emu looking eye to eye with him. Oh, that's pretty good. Right, see here. And that was right in um, at Dr. Boyette's down in um, CB Marina. Do you have any suggestions or tips for readers that want to get into fishing? Um, yeah, if you if you want to get into fishing, you know, you don't really have to have a really expensive boat to get into it. Um, I, I just I have a really nice boat because I want people to go charter fishing with me, and the more money, if you invest into gear, if you have better gear, people would rather go fishing with you. But um, you know, if you want to get into just fishing in the river, you can go out there fishing on a, a 12 foot John boat, $25 rod, you know, some bait, just kind of ease down the shore and just have a good time. That's what I ended up starting on when I was a kid. We uh, had a little 12 foot John boat and two paddles. Um, really, really a lot of time what I do is um, a lot of people know me at the beach 
and um, if they uh, have a captain that's running a full-time boat down there and the captain's sick or if it's during a tournament, they'll call me and want me to run the charter boat for them. And then I have uh, a lot of word of, ma word of mouth people that I do uh, drum charters. And uh, since I do fishing charters, I film on the side. I also do um, movie extra stuff. I kind of have my hand in a little of everything. So um, it's kind of more word of mouth. You know, somebody wants to go along with me or wants me to uh, carry them out on a charter trip. They get up with me and I'll carry them.